Hi everybody, this is just a quick video. Um, I wanted to share uh, a challenge that I'm doing over on the craft hole and the challenge was a birdhouse, an altered birdhouse. Any style, any way you want to do it, it just uh, was supposed to be over the top. So, anyway, I think I achieved that. Um, and the, I couldn't get it all in the in the uh, camera here in the you know in the view uh, except turning it sideways so anyway let me turn it back the other way I don't wanna this is it and I what I did was I used a candlestick which you know I know lots of people do that and I used the uh, the texture I made me some texture paste just out of gesso and glue and sand and um, I think uh, Bonnie Sassy Scrappers uh, I seen her do this a long time ago and I never tried it but this was just a clear crystal candlestick and so I wanted to try it and it turned out it turned out really well because this has been done for it's been done for a week because this took me a long time to do and uh, I've not had any problem with it coming off and this thing's kind of been manhandled anyway because I've done a lot of stuff to it so yeah it's not been babied in it none of it's fell off or anything so yeah it, it's uh, pretty tough stuff so I'm real happy with that and uh, uh, and I glued the this is a little tray right here a little round white china like tray thing that I found I don't really know what it's for but I found it at the thrift store somewhere and um, I glued it onto the candlestick and then I glued the little birdhouse onto the tray the tray's round but it gave me a little front and a little backspace uh, to add stuff you know and I glued everything together with the contact cement or E6000 I don't remember but it's good and sturdy and of course it had a little you know a hangy thing on the birdhouse and I just cut it off so anyway I did it like I said I did a lot of stuff to this and um, I textured the the um, like I said I textured the candlestick and then I put the flowers uh, just kind of spiraled all the way around it as you can see, this thing's pretty heavy. And um, ended up here, and I did finish the underneath just as, as well. And uh, then on the tray, I um, gessoed it and uh, put this pearl drop trim with uh, this other. Um, I don't know, sort of bling trim I had. And uh, I put that all the way around it also. And then I, I painted the birdhouse. It was just, you know, the raw wood. Painted the birdhouse and I added this really, really pretty paper. Let me show you. I think it's a little easier or better because I've covered most of it up. See it? It's really pretty paper. And while I've got it turned around I'll, to the back, I'll just show you the back of it. Um, and I did add flowers all the way around it. And everything, all the flowers, has, and I don't know if you can see it in the camera or not, it all has uh, diamond dust on it. After I got finished with it, I kind of textured it, gessoed it, uh, all the, the flowers and stuff. And then I went back and I put diamond dust all over all of them. So I'm hoping you can see that. And then, like I said, I put the trim and stuff all the way around and stuff. So, anyway, uh, that was the back. And this trim here in the front and the back also. And then for the roof, turn this back around a little bit. And then for the roof, I got the pink flowers. Little, uh, flower. I think there's little roses all the way around it and then I put this flower trim with the, the drop trim pearl drop trim all the way around and then like I said I had the flowers and the bead sprays and all that stuff and uh, I diamond dust on everything 
at the end and then uh, on the front you can see the paper and I did put some bling around the the entries into the little birdhouse and uh, on the little stand I guess uh, and then just some more flowers and stuff and here's my little birdie that lives here I thought it was so pretty just so pretty it just looks so good and this really was the inspiration was the bird was the inspiration for the for the whole birdhouse it looks like someplace this little bird would want to live and uh, it all kind of looks like you know it's getting chilly weather or something it's all iced over or, you know it's the dime of dust makes it really sparkly I, I know y'all probably can't see all that but anyway this is my bird house and uh, so you guys leave me a comment and uh, subscribe if you wish and um, I'll speak to you soon bye